Hello! Contrary to popular belief, Dario8676 is back and we're Let's Playing! Episode number 12 of Let's Play Dragon Warrior 2! Yeah, I know you guys have missed that. And girls, I should say, because I know there's some uh, really hot girls out there that definitely can't, can't get enough of me and just love watching my videos. So for all those, welcome! Where the hell did I leave off? I have no idea. It's been three months since I uploaded a video. Oh, oh. I also have to get this out of the way now because... One of my co-workers, Scato, is, and I don't normally give shout-outs, but I had to because he's the one that kept bugging me to record again, and, well, here I am, so shout-out to Scott! Anyways, okay, back to Let's Playing. How do I do this again? Well, last I left off, I mentioned the Shield of Strength, which costs like 21,000 gold. Um... Yeah, I can't afford that right now, so don't worry about that, even though it's the, one of the best shields in the game. So let's just go around and talk to some people and see what they have to say to us. Why, thank you, stranger. Moving on. How about you? Ro Rogue Fastfinger. No, I have not heard of the name. Wow. That sounds like a rather suggestive name, doesn't it? So there's really nothing too much going on in this town that I can remember. Um... Really, what's interesting is in the Game Boy Color version of uh, Dragon Warrior 2, if you sleep in this inn, your good friend Esgar here, or whatever, the sub-hero, gets violently sick, and you're forced to go with your main character and the princess to find the Leaf of the World tree and save him. A little weird, a little different, I know. What's going on? He has a message for me. Seek the fire monolith. Who gave you that message to tell me? So anyways, um, yeah, I'm back. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. God. Ah, I can save my game here, huh? Well, it looks like uh, the closest person to leveling up is the princess, but I'm not close enough. I guess I'll save the game. Doesn't really matter. Does I wish to continue the quest? Sure. So there's really nothing here that's special. In the ocean far to the east lies an island, and on it are trees from every corner of the world. Of course, they're referring to the leaf of the world tree that I was just talking about. Okay, so we're wasting our time here. Let's just get the hell out of here. And as you can see, our ship is awaiting us already, as well as are the random battles. And, um... I don't remember anything, so I don't remember what is what and what to kill first. Except uh, apparently the Basilic hits like a truck, so let's kill him first. Ah, of course, they scorch out flames. Man, I might as well just run back to the inn already since everyone's already half dead. I mean, I should have expected it though, right? Whoa! He's dead. 191 experience. Let's just heal up. Um, also, off screen three months ago when I actually did some level grinding, Esgar learned the heal more spell. Yay! I don't think I really learned anything else. Let me see. Nah, she has antidote, but that's about it. So, where are we heading to next? I don't know because I just took another two steps and we're already in another battle! Yes! This is Dragon Warrior 2! Man! You take one step, and you fight. And then you take another step, and you fight. And you fight, and you fight, and you fight, and you fight, and until you can't fight anymore. I mean, at this point... You know what? At this point, I might as well just run right, right back to the town and go to the inn! Holy crap! Anadope you. I mean, it's ridiculous. There's so many evil man enemies everywhere. I don't know what to do. It's terrible. It's terrible. 
Let's just sleep at the end. It costs 90 gold. I'm already at 15,000. Now, can I please leave in peace? Can you please stop blocking my way? Thank you. Alright. Let's see if we can take more than five steps without going into a battle now. Come on, come on. We got this. We got this. Yeah. See, it's completely random. So, where are we heading to next? Whoa! I'm just going to run away. I don't feel like dealing with those guys. Oh, I can't run away because this is Dragon Warrior 2! I'll let you know when it's my turn. Run! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! I have no escape. No escape. No escape. I have no escape. No escape. No escape. There you go. There you go. So all we want to do here is head north because we're going to head to the castle of Ostrafair next. So, north we go, until you see that thing. <coughs> then, once you see that thing, we're going to head left. So, I just finished uh, cooking dinner for my family. A uh, little, little different for me. I mean, I'm actually feeling really good. This has been, like, a great month for me, honestly. After the last three horrendous months that I've uh, been through, this has been a really good month, and... Uh, you know, I took care of some things yesterday, and my head is cleared, and... I don't know, I just feel good. I really do. Let's just kill everything! Kill it! Kill it! I feel good. I cooked dinner for uh, my brother and his fiance and my mother and my daddy. And uh, it was rather good. It was, um... What the hell was it called? I don't remember what it was called, but it was some really good Italian dish. It tasted like... It was like a form of ziti, but it was like penne pasta. And it had, uh, it was like some spicy sauce. I don't know. I don't know even what, I don't know what I mean. I can't move! Run away! There you go. Left. Joe left. Joe left. Right, left. Left we go. Up we go. And you'll come here to this little entrance. And there is Osterfair. Let's see if we can actually make it in here. By the way, this area actually has really hard monsters. And we didn't even have to worry about any of them. Welcome to Ostrafir! Let us talk. Beyond lies the Colosseum and the Court of the King. No. So, this takes us in a circle. We'll just go in here. So, before you talk to the King, let's go talk to everyone else in this place and see what they have to say. As the story goes, it was a dark and stormy night when the pirate ship Relentless hit a reef and sank. They s they say that in the ho hold was the Echoing Flute, which we know we already have the Echoing Flute. Do not overburden thyself. Cast away those items. Blah, 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 blah. What do you have for me? The Echoing Flute blows a magical note on an island in a tower in a chamber remote. In a chamber remote, play it and listen, a wise man once wrote. For when the sound echoes their shawl, they'll find a crest of the great power to aid thee in time. Hokey pokey, I like to rhyme. Alright. So, they obviously want me to play the echoing flute, so let's go ahead and play it. It echoes! That means... That means... That means there's a crest here somewhere. I seek the armor of Gaia. I was told that it was kept in a shop that sells armor. Well, that helps, considering every single town in the whole game sells armor. What does this guy have? Giant hammer, magic armor. Magic armor... Magic armor is one of the best armors for... Uh, not the hero, the sub-hero. What's his name? Esgar, I guess. Um, it reduces fire damage taken by 25%. But it's rather expensive. I'm not going to bother buying it just yet, but we'll be back for it. Um, let's go ahead and talk to this guy. I'm a fortune teller. Are they looking for something? I tell you the fortune. That is which the seeks is north. So what we seek is north. That is so helpful. In the island town of Zahan, in the southern ocean, lives a man named Torval who owns the Golden Key. That is actually where we're going to be heading next. 
But first, we got something to take care of in this town. Let's rest up. Good morning! Goodbye. So, let's go talk to the king. That welcome in the castle. If thou entertain me, thou shalt receive a valuable prize. Does this to try? Sure. Go forth in the center of this coliseum. So, finally, after what seems like a, an eternity, we have, I guess, a boss fight or a, whatever they want to call it against the saber line. Very simple strategy to beating this thing. Attack with Dario and defend with the other two characters. Naturally, he attacks Dario, the one that doesn't defend, which is kind of funny, but... You kill him in about two blows, so it's really easy. God. Now, you're going to want to heal, just because he decided to attack Dario. Whoa! <laughs> so that was actually the most unluckiest we could possibly get. He attacked Dario all three times, left him at three health, but we still won. And he dropped the treasure chest with... More gold, sweet. So now that we've destroyed him, that enemy, we can talk to the king. And the king, I shall give thee the moon crest that must fight gallantly. We gives us the moon crest, our first crest of the game. Now, a lot of people are asking, well, where did it go? If you check your stats... It goes into your stats, not into your inventory, which is good because it saves a, a lot of uh, slots and everything. So we got our first crest of the game, the Moon Crest. Very, very good. You get five of them. I think you need four or five to beat the game. Something like that. I don't know. Anyways, now if we talk to the king again. Nothing happens! Until you leave this place. So let's leave. I then come back. So he gave us the moon crest, and now all that happens now if you come back to the town is you can actually use this as a save point, and I do want to save here. Because if I ever have to use the return spell, I want to come back to this town, and this is essentially like the the, the center town of the whole game, where there's the, this is like a middle area, so. And yes, we wish to continue the quest. The strength is that of many of Hippobongos. I don't know about all that. Okay. And that's about it for this place. Uh, we could go around and look, but I don't think we can do anything else here. I'll just go check it out real quick. Let's see. This is a portal. I don't know where that takes us. This is actually a door. Yep. Yep, just lots of golden doors everywhere. Isn't that great? Okay, folks. Well, I guess that about wraps it up. Um, I know you probably expected more from me on the first episode back, but honestly, I'm just trying to ease back into this Let's Playing thing. I mean, I've been away for three months, you know, and it's... I'm rusty, to say the least, so I, I gotta get back into it and just have fun doing it again, because it's been a long time since I've uploaded anything. Guess that's it. In our next episode, we'll head uh, south to a town of Zahan. You'll recognize the town when you see it, but that's where we will get our golden key. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time for more Dragon Warrior 2. Later.